Yo, what's going on, y'all? Before I get into this video, I wanted to show y'all a sequence with uh, Peacemaker. So, he's got this string. It's 2-2 two, two grab. Now, this grab is for real. They have to duck it and release block. Or they have to jump. Or they have to armor. They can't block it. They can't stand block or crouch block. Or they'll get grabbed. And the thing about this grab is you can cancel this grab into EX moves. Or, like, certain other moves. Like, uh, cameo summons or um, uh, back eagly. But, like, the main thing we're going to be looking at is, like, canceling to something like that or something like this to get a little launch, you know what I'm saying? So, this is the thing about him, right? Like, so, 2-2 two, two in the grab is plus 12, and in the corner, there's no pushback. You're right there. And the string is, is 9 frames, the startup. So, you're jailing them if you time it right off of 2-2 two, two grab, and you can do, like, 2-2 two, two into, like, this for, like, a mix-up. So, if they want to duck or jump your grab... Boom, now they're launched off of this. So you can get sequences going with him. Like, if you open someone up in the corner, if, like, you, they think you're going to grab them, then you shimmy them, you can get stuff like this going. Now, I'm not optimal with him, but I can give you a little idea. Okay, I dropped it. Hold on. I'm not optimal with him. I don't know the optimal combo, but I can give you an idea of what you can do. Something like this. Boom, restamp, 53%. Now, the follow-up stand, too, if you do it right, is going to jail. So now you can get stuff like this. Or wait. Now you can get stuff like this going. Boom. That's like 90% sequence, and that was super unoptimal. Or you could do something like this. Boom. Boom. And the fatal blow, now they're dead. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm super unoptimal with them, so I'm sure people can find sequences that kill way quicker than um what i got you could do maybe like i think i saw sonic doing something like this into like back eagly hold on let me let me work this out sorry y'all i haven't really worked out his combos super well okay you could do something like um okay you could do something like this maybe Oh, yeah, and then that resends. Then you get fatal. Oh, my God. Yeah, so the thing about his EX projectile, too, is it always restands, right? So, like, you could get him, like, super deep into a combo. And then it'll restand, and then you can do whatever from there. Like, Peacemaker has, like, some of the most combo potential, even without cameo, that I've ever seen in my life. Like, this launches, this extends, uh, this launches and restands. And then he's got... You can convert meterless gun off of ambushes. You can do 2-2 two, two grab to extend low eagly to get combos from anywhere on the screen. Mid eagly combo stuff. Like he's just got like insane, like unbelievable combo potential. Um and to be honest, I'm not really like a lab combo guy much myself. But I am, you know, gonna try to get into him and get better. But in this video, I wanted to like show my first combat league matches with him but i just wanted to show you all that first give you all an idea of what's going on with them so basically in the corner of the idea is you you get an opening and you try to lead it into 2-2 two, two grab to get that plus 12 restand and then you get a little mix-up going with like 2-2 two, two into burst or 2-2 two, two into grab and you might say you know oh i don't think i have peacemaker selected and then you can get a little um and then you can maybe even try to keep it safe with a cameo maybe try to convert it with cano knives there's a lot to lab there with Peacemaker. He's like, I was going to drop like a guide pretty pretty quickly on him, but there's so much like on him, you know? And then like in neutral and stuff, he's got like um, torpedo into Kano knives, freaking um, anti-gravity into Kano knives. You can do like anti-gravity into a jump kick into another anti-gravity. Like he's got big combos and he's like got a lot of like shenanigans like uh just mid screen and in neutral so like it seems like they like really tried to make him fun like they really tried to make him a fun character to play you notice how my record is is like 850 something and his is three and four it's because they already started playing combat league when you start playing a new combat league season your record resets so mine will reset after this all right see as you can see, I'm starting to play like a dumbass already. Playing like a dumbass with Peacemaker is just... Just where it's at, kind of. Oh no, I'm in trouble. 
His gun projectile is pretty good. Now, Asher can duck and punish me with her, um, with her, um, sorry, y'all. Focus. <laughs> with her 4-2. Her 4-2, her really long advancing high um, normal. So I got to be careful of that. Gotta be a little patient here. I'm gonna wake up with my armor move into Kano Knives. And now I'm gonna do anti gravity, trying to close it out. Yep. They could have up blocked it. The anti gravity elbow drop, it's minus one on block, but it becomes minus 36. With, um. They could have converted that. They were just a little short, though. It becomes minus 36 if they up block. Okay. Let me see if I can get an Eagly. Yep. Let me see if I can get Eagly again, the sequel. Getting a little Kano pressure going. Nice. I shouldn't have delayed my Ford 4 there. Ford 4 already kind of has like a built-in delay because it's a little slow. So, um... I shouldn't have delayed my Ford 4 there. It is a 19 frame mid, so... I gotta throw it out kind of quick. Yeah, raw... Oh my god. My conversions and my hit confirms are not the best yet with this fool. I'm just gonna... He's low on life. So I'm just going to start doing dumb shit in the Kano to stay safe. Ooh, so the way I did knives in the anti-gravity there, it actually made me more minus. Okay. So I learned right there. I got to time that a little bit different. Now, I might be dead. Ostra's Fatal Blow does a lot. I think I'm fine, though. All right, let me do something dumb into... um. Ooh, that was good. Okay. So Torpedo does not go under Serena Knives. So we learned again there. We learned again. Okay. A little anti-gravity. Okay. Oh, I was a little late there. He confirming his jab in the gun Kano is a little tricky. Trying to get better at it. Now, I might try to fraud here. Let me try to land a poke. And then I'm going to try to fraud with this. Ooh, nice. Nice stuff. They probably already got some Peacemaker experience. This character, um, pretty common, right? People are trying to play the new DLC and all that. Huh? Huh? Try to, yep, down one torpedo. Try to get an eagle for the win. Ooh, nice block. Me, um, okay. Anti-gravity. Into grab. Let's go. So, anti-gravity, whenever you cancel it, it, um, there's a lot of recovery. So, I notice people, they try to up-block me. And I try to like just anti-gravity empty into grab to punch that up block. But anti-gravity when you just land, it recovers really slow. So that doesn't really work as you can see right there. They actually tried to up block my elbow drop and then recovered um, in time. But I still got, I stuck under a stand too, got the grab. It was an ugly situation that really panned out for me. Oh, this is going to be a big combo. Boom, boom, boom. Now, let's see if I can get a little mix-up going. Ooh. Ooh, you see that? That's like a... That's like a, um... Almost 80% life sequence. Ooh, now they're dead. Ooh, I messed it up. They're, they would have been dead. Let me get a little chip sequence going with Kano. Yeah, so I like to do that long mid-string into Torpedo into Kano Ball. I don't know if that's the go-to sequence yet, but it's just... Something I've been messing around with, something I like... So see, I am minus 36 there because of that up block. Nice shot by them. I've got a decently competent opponent for our first match, which is, which is good. Ooh, got him. That would have been a nice little combo. Nice up block. Nice up block. No confirming to Serena, though. All right, let me see. I'm going to do mid Eagly. Nice little ender there. Now I'm going to try to play keep away here. I have a nice life lead. Let me see if I can't get, yep, meter burn gunshots. Ooh, uh, that would have been the kill if I would have got that. Okay, so his down three, it's very long. But as you can see there, it's not very plus. So I'm very minus right there, but they don't know. Getting away with early DLC knowledge. Did you use that person? So there was some sloppy play there for me. Whenever I landed that EX gun mid screen, I could have converted into Eagly, into 2 2 grab, into EX burst, and that would have been a big combo, would have killed, but you know, I messed that up. I'm only level 2 with Peacemaker. I have played a bit with him, it's just, it's only been private match. 
and the game still doesn't um give you uh XP for private match. So unfortunately I don't have any brutalities unlocked, any gear, stuff like that. Um I noticed also they put they swap next opponent in friendly rematch, so that's convenient too. So if you just want to get to the next opponent, you can mash A, which is more natural, right? Because if you're wanting to get to the next thing, you're going to mash, like, uh, continue. Um, whereas they had it swapped last time, so you'd be like, wait, no, stop. No friendly rematch. So it's good that they swapped that. People were complaining about that. All right, it looks like this person's ping is kind of jumping around. Even though it's wired. I don't know, but I'm going to play him, though. The ping is, like, rising a lot. Do y'all see that? Not really sure what's going on. All right, his majesty. Okay. Record two and one. So it is early in the season. So everyone, everyone's in these lower apprentice ranks. So if you have a positive record, you're going to be pretty decent. So this player is probably not going to be too bad. Going to hit him with low eagly to start. No punish from them. Ooh, so they're using Katana's armor to, uh, to launch with Scorpion. That's very good. Gonna try to land a random low eagly. Torpedo into Kano Knives. Get Kano Knives out again to anti-gravity. Down three to grab. Let's go. Now I want to land like a random eagly to get stuff started. Blocking that. Torpedo. Kano Knives into Torpedo. See, mid-screen, he is like a lot of shenanigans. Ooh, that was a good little mix-up. I like that. Back Eagly. Okay, if if they ducked that gunshot, I would have done Torpedo into Kano there. See, uh, full screen, neutral, stuff like that. He's a lot of shenanigans. Big damage if he lands, a lot of shenanigans. So I feel like he's supposed to be played. Oh, I could have converted that into more. Ooh, okay, nice. Armored launch into Scorpion. Seems like that's like a go-to strategy for them right now. Ooh, nice. Nice meaty. See if I can bait an armor. Ooh, input error. I was really trying to bait an armor there because it seemed like armor into Scorpion's like their favorite thing. Okay, little anti gravity. Ooh, nice. That's the that's the Majesty Classic right now. Oh, I messed up again. I'm really struggling with that conversion right now with Eagly. Ooh, nice. All right, I'm gonna wake up. Oh no, that might be it for me. Yep, that's game one. That was good. Yeah, so my conversions right now aren't looking so good. And also, um, also I need to bait the armor more. Because even though Katana's armor launches with Scorpion's Ambush, Scorpion's Ambush does not cover that on block. So if I block Katana's wake up, it, she's going to be right there for me to full combo punish. Okay, so I'm going to start this match. I think I'm going to jump in to start. Try to get a conversion. Oh, nice. V2 it. Ooh, into the Scorpion convert. Okay. Could have converted that into something more. But it's all good. There, this is going to be a big conversion if they don't break. In the mid eagly. Ooh, I can actually go into a restand here. Ooh, catch him. Convert. Uh huh. That was a nice conversion by me. The conversions improved from last game. Okay. Start with torpedo. Nice block. Not a good punish, though. Which is good for me. Get some eagly going. Get some anti-gravity going. Ooh, the backup in the scorpion overhead that catches me. Ooh, can I catch him? Yep. Okay. Oh, the raw scorpions are really catching me. Okay, that was good. I think I'm dead. Let me try to mash here, but I think I'm dead. Yeah, the raw scorpions are really clocking me right now. 
Oh yeah, I'm dead for sure. All right, I gotta watch out for that. And that's safe on block too, so that's really good to throw out like that. Ooh, this should be a big convert. Nice. Got the breaker out of there. I hit Scorpion there. That was cool. Close frames. Grab. Nice tech. Eagly. Yep. Repeat on the Kano. Minus two. I'm going to mash. Oh, yeah. There's a gap in that string. Yep. And I got my armor torpedo on there. One, one. Let's go. Let's go. Adaptation a little bit. Well, that wasn't necessarily adaptation. I just kind of mauled there. I still haven't adapted well to what they're doing. That's fighting games, though. Sometimes you win off of um, adapting well to what they're doing. And sometimes you win off of just mauling them, you know? All right, I'm going to start the game with Torpedo, I think, and Nakano. Ooh, so is Eagly... Okay, so Eagly counts as a projectile. Okay. Understood. The anti-gravity going. Ooh, this should be a decent combo. That, that was the wrong move. That has a gap, though. Ooh, that's good. That's going to launch, too. Goes under my gunshots, and that's going to launch. Okay. See if I can get a little bait here. Got him. This will kill. Okay. I was going to say that will kill. Ooh. So I did the anti-gravity cancel into the jump in, into the jab, hit confirm. Let's go. Into the fatal blow. Let's go. Maybe a waste of fatal blow. I could have just done maybe like sonic boom into like raw torpedo or forward four torpedo, but... Regardless, we got it. We're new to the character, so the conversions and the hit confirms are not going to be. There's going to be, there's going to be a lot left to be desired, you know, or whatever the term is. All right. Oh no, that's bad. Ooh, that, okay, nice. Nice confirm with the mid. Ooh, that. I've never seen these katana strings. Nice. Nice down two. I feel they're a decent pl Even though they're two and one on Combat League, they know what they're doing. They're down two in ambush sequences and like all that stuff. Okay. Got him. Could have converted that with Eagly. Yeah, I need to, need to start getting that down. That was really good. Okay, my timing with Kano is not good yet. Oh, I could have had him. Nice. It's going to be close. Okay, and they got sub on. Ooh, convert. Torpedo into Kano. Just Kano. I don't know what I'm doing. My... Oh. Choking. Let's go. Raw Torpedo. Let's go. When in doubt, just Raw Torpedo out. Yeah, that was a that was a little bit of a choking like scramble there, but I got it, y'all. And um, that's gonna be it for the recording. I think appreciate y'all much love. Hope you learned a thing or two in this video. Obviously, my peacemaker quite crusty, but you know I'm trying to learn stuff like that. Hope everyone's uh, having a great time. Hope you're enjoying gaming, whether it be MK Tekken, whatever. And uh, much love.